small acts. Small acts of physical contact are another huge pointer, when it comes to signs of love from a man's body language, that he's totally into you, a hand to the shoulder, or hand on your knee, brushing away your hair from the face, holding hands, or just running fingers through your hair or arm, it's these small things that give out a big message of love. He leans toward you when you talk. In a noisy bar, this sign might not hold much weight. But when he can physically hear you perfectly well, and leans in anyway, it means he's interested in what you have to say, and you in general. He faces you. You may have never noticed that this is a body language, of men falling in love. But when a guy is really interested in you, he'll always face you with his whole body. His chest, torso, pelvis, and toes will point in your direction. If he's facing towards you, you've definitely caught his attention, and he wants more. When he starts leaning in towards you, he's really digging your vibe, pay attention to how a man positions himself in your company, if he's distant and facing away, then he's not interested. Before we continue, I have a special training guide for women's, about what men want you to know, but will never tell you. Check the link in the description to know more. You'll feel like you have x-ray vision into any man's mind. He shows you his front teeth. Guys stop smiling like this around the age of 5, unless they're really happy, he might not show off a toothy grin, while casually flirting, but on a really awesome date when he's having loads of fun, look for teeth, when he feels really happy, he's not covering that up. They sit on the floor. There are certain signs that show a man is comfortable with you. When he sits on the floor, it shows he is not intimidated by you, and wants to be more open with you. If he sits on the floor and holds your hands, he wants to get to know you better, and have deep conversations about the meaning of life. He smiles when he sees you. When your guy greets you with a blank face, he's probably losing interest. But if he flashes his pearly whites at you, then he's obviously happy to see you, he thinks you're gorgeous, funny, and fascinating. When he keeps smiling at you, throughout the time that you spend together, then you're making him happy, and he wants to keep spending quality time with you. Eye contact. If your man is confidently making eye contact while talking, and even while listening, it's a big yes. Shying away from making a direct eye contact, or being uncomfortable in holding your gaze, are signs of lack of love and interest. So it's time to hold that gaze, and see how far that goes. They keep their arm around you in public. When men haven't decided if they want to keep you around long term, they will often keep a safe distance from you in public. If he places his hand on your shoulder or waist, this man is marking his territory in the most primal sense. He's telling the other men not to consider you as an option, even if he is not conscious of it. He takes care of his appearance in your presence. The body language of men falling in love, also includes his appearance. If he takes care of the way he looks for you, that means he wants to impress you. Even minor grooming in your presence, means he wants to look good for you, like stroking his hair to make sure it's perfectly quaffed or adjusting his tie even though there's nothing wrong. He walks beside you. If he's constantly two steps ahead of you, it means he's more concerned about himself than you, unless he's leading you through a scary or crowded space, he should adjust his pace to match yours. He does everything possible to make you comfortable. Is he offering you his jacket? Has he gotten you an extra blanket when you said you were cold? Did he buy you gloves because he noticed your hands are cold often? If he is being extra thoughtful of your level of comfort, he's getting ready to drop the bomb on you in a good way. Help you're ready, because the sky is on cloud 9 and will tumble for you. Number 9, he wants to commit to you. You know what kind of man wants commitment from a girl? The kind of man who is seriously enamored with the girl he wants to commit to. If you were to ask the vast majority of men out there, they'd tell you that they aren't afraid of commitment. Rather, they're petrified of committing to the wrong girl. If the guy you're seeing is pushing for commitment, it's a sign that he's emotionally attached to the point, that he thinks you're the one, or at the very least, better than any other girls around him. 
Number 8, he calls and texts first. He wants to keep up communication with you. This is just something guys do, when they're into you in general. He'll be the one to initiate conversations, dates, and the like. The more he does this, the more attached he really is. Number 7, he asks for your opinion. He really cares about what you think. Whenever he needs help, he knows he can come to you. He knows you won't judge him, or tell him I told you so. He knows you'll help him as much as you can. When he needs advice, he will seek yours, because he knows that you will do your best to give him a suggestion that is in his interest. He likes the way you think and he respects your thoughts, that's why he wants to hear your opinion. Number 6, You Have Great Conversations One of the foundations of a solid relationship, is to be able to talk about things that light you both up. Maybe it's your shared love of anime, or 18th century Russian literature. Whatever that shared interest is, you and he love engaging in thought-provoking dialogue. There's never a lull in the conversation. He challenges you to think and learn. Who needs that with a fling? This is the stuff boyfriends are made of. Number 5, he gives you a look that's both happy and teary-eyed. You know that look you get, when you're looking at something that you've always wanted, and finally have. That's the look a man gives when he's deeply in love with a woman. It's a look of bliss, adoration, and at the same time, admiration. That look is one that can't easily be replicated, even by top actors in Hollywood. It's rare to actually see a guy give this look in person, but once you see it, it'll become unmistakable for the rest of your life. Number 4, he tells you intimate details about him and his life. When you two sit down to talk, and he divulges deep and meaningful information about his life, he's already hooked. Guys don't just go around dishing out that kind of stuff on a whim. It means he trusts you, and wants you to know a deeper side of him. That's usually because he wants to know a deeper side of you, and is already attached to you. Letting you inside his world is huge. Number 3, he's introduced you to his friends and family. It's really scary to meet someone's friends and family. What if you don't like them? What if they don't like you? No one is going to put themselves through that, or their significant other through that, unless they've got investment into that person, and into where the relationship is going. Plus, if he's considering committing and taking the relationship to the next level, how well you get along, and mesh with his family and friends is going to be important to him, just like it's important to you, how well he gets along with your family. So, if he's made a point to introduce you to his friends and family, that's a very good sign. It means he wants you to meet all the important people in his life, because you're becoming an important person in his life. Number 2, he likes spending time with you. This is one of the most obvious signs he is emotionally attached to you. He will use his free time which was usually reserved for relaxation for you. He will go and hang out with you because he likes you, and he definitely has some feelings for you. I know, some of you may say, it's because he thinks he can have sex with you, but what if you've took sex off the table? What then? If he still hangs out with you, does it mean that he is with you only because he is interested in taking advantage of you? You see, it doesn't because he really has no ulterior motive. Your relationship is not physical, it's not sexual because you are not friends with benefits, so you can be sure he is not in it for the sex. He is in it because he likes you. Number 1, you're a priority to him. Any man who wants to be with you, will make you a priority. No matter what's going on in his life, he'll find a way to make time for you. You'll notice this most when he has to shuffle his schedule around, because he wants to be there for you, even just for a single date night. I hope you enjoyed the video, if you find it useful, don't forget to share it, and make sure to subscribe to see more video in the future. Thanks for watching, and see you soon.